Kundalini awakening. This in the spiritual world is a big term and there's a lot of misinformation about it. So let's see if we can get into this a little deeper and make some better understanding of what a Kundalini awakening is. You know, in my yoga teacher training, I did Kundalini yoga and I was taught um, with the Yogi Bhajan way. It was a very safe way to help uh, open up the Kundalini energy. Kundalini energy is energy that is at the base of the spine. Everyone has it. And this energy, once it, it starts to activate, it comes up the spine and it, and it purifies all your chakras. And as it makes its way up to the crown, it opens you up to source, to God, and it turns on all your spiritual gifts. You feel connected to everything and everyone uh, at a very, very deep level. And it's a different awakening for everyone, right? But some people, the awakening has happened very quickly and that can be a very uncomfortable experience. So this is why I like Kundalini Yoga. It's a very slow way to activate this. And also the Kundalini Mudra, I'll have it pinned to the top of my platform that you can look after this to see if you want to slowly awaken on a nice, easy, slow, consistent pace to help awaken that Kundalini energy. So let's talk about what it feels like when this uh, energy starts to activate, okay? Because it makes its way up the shashuna, which is the spine up to the crown. So when it first starts to awaken, a lot of people will feel a tingling in that lower section of their body and their spine. They'll feel a light tingling. You'll find that your intuition starts to really become active and strong, meaning you'll be able to know just things, your clear cognizance. You'll just have this deep inner knowing about a lot of things. You'll start to feel at peace and at one with everything, uh, every living being, um, and it'd be very powerful. And that is a sign of the ego dissolving, that, that separation that the ego gives us. Um, you'll be coming more into your higher self, and that is why you'll feel connected to everything at a very deep level. You will experience cathartic releases of emotional baggage. So all this stuff that you suppressed, it'll start to come up to the surface, and you'll have to be able to clear that stuff as it comes up. And a big one, you'll start to feel a sense of purpose in your life, right? Your job, uh, friends that are just resonating in those lower vibrations, you will just feel like you they don't resonate with you anymore and you'll be moving forward into a much higher state of consciousness where you want to step into your life's purpose. So I hope that brings a little more insight into a Kundalini awakening and how it is such a beautiful, natural thing, that energy that God gave us, it's just there to be awoken and it's up to us to help stimulate that and awaken that. I wanna know from you guys, have you had a Kundalini awakening? How was the experience? Um, I'm fascinated with this stuff. It, it's because everyone's experience is different. Let me know in the com comments, Soul Tribe. I love you guys, have a great day.